Here we are on 13 approach. You can see it's that time of year again when the worms are working pretty aggressively. See quite a few mounds here. This isn't terrible, but it's not good. Makes things kind of messy when we mow. Probably gets in the way of your ball a little bit. There really is no way to control worms legally. Um, they seem to be becoming more and more of a problem. Uh, people think they're not on sand, or if you say on top dress, that'll alleviate the problem. But obviously we're on sand and we've got plenty of them. So we do do things that try to dissuade the worms from coming and staying. There's some products that have tea saponins in them that irritate the worms and make them go elsewhere or come to the surface and then they'll die from exposure, but not really a good way to get rid of them. Uh, like I say, keeping the soil dry and trying some of those products has worked marginally well for us, but uh, still can't eliminate them. Mostly a problem during the spring and fall, kind of disappear during the summer. But you can see there's quite a few mounds here. Another interesting thing on this green for some reason, I see a few of these elsewhere, but on this green there's probably a hundred of these millipedes crawling around this morning. The other morning there was even more, probably a couple hundred, but here on 13 green there's a bunch of them and a few elsewhere. But anyway, we see these generally during the fall too, um, about every year, but it seems to be quite a few uh, quite a few more this year quite an interesting little creature so anyway that's a little report on the worm situation on 13 collar here uh, again it's a, another beautiful morning here at wild horse see some lovely clouds nice north wind it's another great fall day